creates. And you're watching Clean and Chit Chats, episode six. So today I have quite a lot of ponies to clean. And I also want to talk a bit about G5, so let's have a clean and let's have a chat. So Generation 5 is Among Us. And supposedly, if I'm right, the movie for G5 should be coming out in August. And I have planned this episode to be out in August, so hopefully you're seeing this in August. <laughs> so G5 is going to be introduced by a phony movie, which will be available on Netflix. And a lot of people are hyped to see it. But I'm going to be honest, when I first saw it, like when I first saw like the bed sheet, <laughs> Yes, the dreaded bed sheet. <laughs> the bed sheet that had really bad pony art. <laughs> I was like, ew, that is disgusting, kill it with fire. And I just really didn't like the look of the ponies on the bed sheet. It's just the art was so bad. Then I saw the movie art and my first impression was kill it with fire. <laughs> It's just like the first impression seemed to be like a very big change comparing to G4. And the teeth on the ponies made me feel very uncomfortable. I don't know why, it's just like the teeth just freaked me out and so does this Luna. <laughs> and I was just like, oh my god, it looks horrible, I hate it. Then it started to like sink in a bit and I kind of got more used to it. And I think I kind of like it a lot better now than I did like <laughs> in my first impression. I mean, I don't think, like, I hate it anymore or anything. Like, I mean, I think everybody got, like, a bad first impression because of the dreaded bed sheet. <laughs> then I think for me personally, it kind of made this sort of knock-on effect. So it kind of, like, somehow created this illusion that all of the art is bad in a way. I don't know. <laughs> but now, due to the new leaks of images, that I've seen on Instagram. Oh my god, I just want to say that I've washed away like the cutie mark. Like, do you know, can you remember that like penned marked on like little kawaii looking face on this rarity? Well, a bit of fairy liquid has got it off, so whoop. So anyway, <laughs> when I saw like the new sort of leaks on Instagram, my opinion started to slowly change and I started to get more warmed up to them. And they don't actually look as bad as I initially thought. I think it was just like the shock factor of new ponies in a new sort of art style. So now I don't really mind the art style that's for the movie. I mean, it's not really that far off really for my G4. It's not like ridiculously far off, I don't think. Since it's like inspired by like someone's like art, like fan art. And to be fair, like that might not be like the art style or like the actual episodes after like the movies like being done and stuff. So they may like have a different sort of like, like a bit of a different sort of style for like the actual episodes when they get round to it. Like in the G4 2017 movie, like the art style changed slightly and it was also more like 3D sort of thing, sort of looking. So far there's only five main characters and I think they're definitely gonna add like a six like main character either in the movie on episode but I, I would probably think that will do it in the movie I have, a, I have a feeling there's going to be another pony joining the crew in the movie so there'll be six all together so yeah the thing about like the designs of the ponies like I think the colors are too similar I just don't really like how Pip and Izzy's colors are very similar and Hitch and Sunny's colours are also kind of similar. And I just think that it's kind of lazy for them to like design them like to look so similar with each other. I mean, who designed these ponies? Like, and like, what were they thinking of like the colours? Because they just look like the same. Like Hitch and Sunny, they have like, they both have like orange as like the body colour. And Pip and Izzy's body colours are all pretty similar and like the same too. And I just think it's kind of like lazy designing, like making them all look so like similar to each other. And the only pony that's actually different is Zip. <laughs> Zip's like the only one that like stands out sort of thing and I think like the all should like technically like stand out more because it's just kind of boring how they all look similar and it's just like a lazy design and in my opinion because they all look so similar and everything. I just think it would be more like interesting and just like better if they were all like had different colours and like different colour stories and not too like samey 
as like all the rest, like as everyone else sort of thing. Cause in friendship is magic with like the main six. There was very like many color differences in all the characters and stuff and that's like a good thing cause it makes them stand out and makes them like their own sort of character cause they don't look similar to each other at all sort of thing. So I kind of prefer it if like, you know, if they were more creative in like the color palette of the ponies, you know, you know, you know what I mean? <laughs> so just like literally judging by like the appearance like of like the ponies. So far, Zip is my favorite and that's just like purely for now just based on like appearance and looks just because like they stand out. They're the only white pony and everyone else looks so samey and it's just boring and I just, yeah, I just, I wish like the ponies just stood out more and be more individual sort of thing. So Zip's my favorite even though that they're literally like a rainbow rainbow dash copy but they look different and everything and i don't i mean i don't know what sort of character they're gonna have i think they're probably gonna be very similar to like rainbow dash because i think it was like apparently mentioned somewhere that like um zip is basically rainbow dash so but i thought like they kind of make you know like give that pony their own personality and their own like does every pony like a different sort of personality and not too samey and it's just like yeah <laughs> also i think the names for the g5 ponies are like more human like than like the g4 ponies because we have pinkie pie sort of shy then like in g5 it's like izzy and sunny and they're more like humanish humanish sort of names not like my little pony sort of names if you know what i mean and that's like a side note i think i'm starting to take like a liking to izzy because of the cutie mark like soon as i seen like the cutie mark it instant it instantly reminded me of my aussie's cutie mark and um, this is like a terrible terrible painted job because this is like one of my first ever customs that i made so of course it's gonna be terrible and not only that my cutie mark is actually really detailed and it's really difficult to paint on and everything but um, my cutie mark is meant to be like a music note that's like got like paint splashes all over like the music note right and it's meant to have like letters like of the al alphabet in like side the music note obviously you can't see them because I, I, I didn't know how to draw them on or anything so yeah it's meant to have like letters inside the music note as well and like the little like colorful circles as you can see them are actually meant to be pinheads like sticking inside like the music note to represent like my hobby sewing and it's just like all of my different hobbies and things that i like all at once and i like colorful things as well so that's why it's all colorful because i love color and i just love art and clowns and everything so that yeah and like izzy's cutie mark is kind of like it's, it's like a heart and it's got like a button in it and it's got like some like two or three it's got three pins in it like the button is kind of like a moon like it's like a moon shaped button sort of thing i could show you a photo but i'm scared because of copyright and stuff and it's like google images and it says images may be subject to copyright so i can't actually share um even though some people a lot of youtubers do put google images in like the videos and they don't deal with copyright and stuff so yeah i just don't want to i just don't want to share just in case i mean you can google like izzy moonbeam cutie mark and then you'll see it so i really like their cutie mark and i think i'm starting to take a liking to that character just because of the cutie mark and you know they kind of look mysterious with like purple the low key remind me a bit of luna and everything so yeah i'm gonna wash all of these little ponies manes now since the conditioner has been in the manes and the tails for quite a while now and i'm gonna clean these ones off camera i did brush the manes out but you know these like light up and stuff so i can't get them wet just in case it like damages them so i'm gonna just gently go over them with like a sponge and try and be careful while clean these or you could clean these with like a floor wipe or arse wipe i'm kidding <laughs> or something but yeah I, I might just wash the hair like normally but off camera though off camera and this little flurry heart and doggy spike doggy spike and we just have this rainbow dash figure here hello so that is about it for this video let me know down in the comments who is your favorite generation 5 main five character <laughs> in the comments it's weird saying not like it's weird not saying main six anymore you know I, th it will be a main six I, I'm, I have a lot of confidence that they're gonna add in another character so i'm just saying like for now it's the main five but in the future it's definitely gonna be the main six i can see it happening in the stars the stars are going to align but yes, let me know who is your favorite character so far in the J5 lineup. I think I might low key kind of, I'm starting to like Izzy just because of the cutie mark. And when I kind of look at them more like individual ponies, I'm like, oh, I kind of like Izzy's design. But it's kind of hard because they look so similar to the other one. Is a Pip? Pip, yes. And everything. But 
yeah it's just kind of like oh they look the same i have no interest sort of thing it's just it's just very samey and i don't really like samey ponies so it's just it's just i don't know what what why <laughs> why i don't know it just annoys me that they made like the designs so similar to each other if the siblings i don't care they that's no excuse you know twilight and her brother that they, they look different so enough said enough said also leave your thoughts and opinions on generation 5 down below be free to leave a cheeky little like and a friendly little comment and as always thank you so much for watching and bye